majority of what you have here. You will see me exploring lines. You can see lines of these things. Mm -hmm. And then what that actually suggests is the fact that um, you know, uh, I applied electronic panels, you want to see what you know, as a metaphor in interrogating the advent I and mean, the effect, the impact of technology in our world today. Right. Yes. So what I actually did, aside from the fact that I you know, literally use electronic panels as material to create that piece which I tried to raise the you know, in the series. You know, I also, you know, tra transposed the lines at the back of the, uh, what's it called? Uh, come on, look at this. When you see the pictures here, look at this. Look at this line. Right. This is a typical, uh, what's it called? Uh, uh, panel. Just a tiny one. You know, the one you can insert in your system, even in your hand. Right? So, these are, so, I transpose these lines to achieve this. Exactly. So, you can see me exploring that. In, there are five numbers. What about them? Right. That's a series. Those exactly are series. So that line, that's the same thing here. I also went for that. Those lines. That was what I just said. Exactly. Exactly. Now, if you look know at the thing that I have done, right? For instance, this particular series is titled Landmines and Road Mines. What do you get from that? It's about the fact that uh, we talk about internet space, right? To me, it's a landmine and road mine. What is a landmine? That is, you know, a line filled with dynamite that can explode. If you know how to navigate, it's also a gold mine if you know how to handle it. If you're talking about black, certainly this is acrylic, right? Look at how boldly this is applied. It's about the fact that I see this, I use this as a metaphor regarding strength, power, right? As a black man, right? Now, We've not been empowered by technology, right? It now depends on how we want to handle it because it's like a, a, a sword with a two edge, I and mean, it's at least a two edge thing. It depends on how you want to use it. So, these, these, and these, these are the areas where it's fun, and also over there, right? And I was telling you that your app is like a fingerprint. If you look at the space, are they looking almost the same thing? But all you need to do is just look at them critically and you see the image, right? So, there is no way you can say, oh, you want to repeat, except if it's a print. These are the print, right? It's a drawing. Yeah, these are drawings. How technology has efforts, even in terms of music production, yes. right? In a scientific field, look at that fish, for instance. You know, I tried to create species. With the advent or with the help of technology, new discoveries are new, new species of animals have been discovered with the power of technology, right? I tried to be multitasking, right? That's the woman who is typing. As she's typing, maybe in the kitchen, she's just yeah. cooking, right? <laughs> so, so with the aid of technology, she could do many things. This is part of it. Yes, I've been exploring the wool for for ages, and in this time around, I'm actually using this to admit to how in the stock market you have the bullish market, you have the uh, bearish market. That's you know, the area where you have the, the rich and the powerful, you know, where they, they operate, right? Mm -hmm. And I don't think with the, with the advent of technology, I think the trend has changed on how this market operates, yes. right? So in the past, and there are two ways that are commonly used to describe whether the stock is rising or falling, right? So that is, you know, when it's, when it's uh, bullish, which means it's, it's rising, and when it's bearish, certainly it's uh, you know, going down. You know? So these, Either way, technology is playing its role. And that was where I mentioned the fact that you can also see me exploring the line to allow to the fact that technology is also playing its role in those uh, in that market. In, in, in that market. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. the rhythm, uh, rhythm of the moment, mm -hmm. right? I'm actually looking at, you know, the, the rhythm of the moment. What I mean by that was that um, in today's um, world, for the for, for technology, the advent of the technology of social media, you say, ah, this is unusual, I've not seen this before. Mm -hmm. But those things have been happening before. Mm -hmm. It's with the aid of uh, social media now, those things have been projected onto us more. Yes. You know? So the lines too, that is what I explored further here. You know? mm -hmm. uh, they, they are called track, track lines. 
track lines on the on, uh, on the circuit board. Yeah, track lines. That's what I actually use to explain it. And you can also see for that sake, even you know at uh, cultural sphere, you know, this is a mask, right? You can see how as we introduce the track lines here, you know, to suggest how technology has helped us to ex explore, I mean expose, you know, project our cultural heritage to the entire world. Pillars, I think you know, pillars, you know, um, that is the pillars of tech, uh, tech lab You know, what's cool, you know, labyrinth is about, you know, you neg negotiating the cyberspace. It's, a, it's more or less a continuation of old man and landmine, because it's serious. Right? It's like, you want it to navigate this, right? At the same time, whatever advancement we've made today has to be with the fact that it was, that, uh, 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 what's it called? Acknowledgement should be given to technology, science and technology, because uh, yes, we've made progress as, as a people, right? But without technology as a support, we'll be nowhere. Mm. So that's it.